Hello, it's Carrie. All I'm going to say is I do not like technology. <laughs> and I really have to blame it on my phone. When I do videos, I do them from my phone. Um, and my phone has been giving me some issues ever since we got back from vacation. So I'm not sure what's going on. I get little notifications that tell me um, my storage space is full, so I don't have enough room for a video. So that's why it's been cutting me off before I'm finished. And I truly, truly apologize. I'm gonna try to get it fixed before um, I do any more videos so this doesn't have to happen again. But we are going to pick up where we left off on my little blue coop collection. And I believe when I was so rudely interrupted, <laughs> we were talking about this beautiful uh, blue scoopable here. So I will go back and um, just repeat the info from this in case you um, missed it on the first one. This is in the scent Blueberry Smurf. Um, scent notes are blend of blueberry muffin, blueberry cheesecake, buttercream frosting, and vanilla pound cake. That sounds heavenly. And it is in this beautiful blue color. This is in a five ounce jar. Oh, okay, we'll talk about how good this smells in just a second. But I want to show you, oops, some of that just fell out. That's what I'm saying. Like, it is so crumbly. Like when I opened up the jar and when I squeeze the sides of the jar, like it just kind of begins to crumble. And when I touch it, it feels very sandy. Um, but it smells divine. <laughs> I get that blueberry. Mm, it is not artificial smelling at all. I'm getting all these bakery notes. Oh, it's interesting because I get blueberry cheesecake before I get the blueberry muffin. Oh, it smells so good. I think I might have litter on my nose. Mm, it is creamy. That might be the vanilla or the buttercream frosting. It is delicious. Oh, I cannot wait for this. I did want to show you um, what she sent me for the two scoopables that I ordered. She sent me these plastic little green spoons. So I got one for each of the scoopables. And then, excuse me, <laughs> to round out my order i did pick up two of their foaming sugar scrubs and the first one i got was in the scent coconut cream and these are both uh, 4.1 ounces oh no i'm sorry scratch that the coconut cream foaming sugar scrub is 4.1 ounces and then it looks like i guess i misread this other one that i picked up is a whipped soap so it is 2.7 ounces, totally fine. I thought I got both scrubs, but I'll be excited to try the whip. So this coconut cream sugar scrub, we'll open it up, so pretty. I don't know if you can see, but there's like some teeny tiny little, I guess those aren't really sparkles, looks like little gems on the top. Mm, that's nice. It's light, but it's nice. Yeah, that's really good. I'm gonna try out her consistency. Yep, exactly what a sugar scrub should feel like. I feel those little grains of sugar. Oh, and it smells really, really, really good. So I am going to enjoy that. And then the whipped soap. Now I kind of branched out with this one. This is in Mocha Truffle. And I've never really tried any body care in coffee scents, but um, 
it just kind of intrigued me a little bit. I was like, okay, I love to drink coffee. I love to smell coffee, so why not have my skin smell like coffee? <laughs> and um, again, this is not a sugar scrub. This is a whipped soap. And it has those same little gold gems on the top. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love the way it smells. I get that coffee note, but it is not like that bitter coffee. It is a sweet, I almost like it. Yeah, okay, it's mocha, so that makes sense. I get like a chocolatey, caramelly note in this. Oh, that is so good. Kind of glad I branched out and went for the coffee. That's going to be fun. And I also wanted to show y'all, um, I got these awesome wooden spoons for the scrub and the soap. So, I mean, how fun and how cute are these? Might even hold on to these um, when I'm done and save them for future soaps and scrubs. So, thank y'all, Little Blue Coop, for these. That's great. Okay. This was going to be short and sweet. Um, I just really wanted to upload part two so you could see what a great collection this was. And um, I hope that you will consider giving them a visit on their Etsy site. And again, I apologize for having to break this up into two parts. Hopefully we won't have to do it anymore. Um, but I did want to make sure I got both of these uploaded for y'all tonight. And um, we will see y'all next time. Until next time though, take care, be happy, be safe, and find something to melt or warm that makes you smile. Bye guys, I'll see you next time.